All right, so I was about to start making the moves for uh, the fourth army over here, and then I went upstairs. I forgot what number I was. Um, I had rolled uh, down uh, when I used the d60 there for the probability uh, down the probability hall to figure out uh, which Sun Tzu quote to read today, and uh, so I went and re-rolled, and I ended up getting number nine, which is. And then I went, okay, you've got to change tack here, then, dude. Um, it's, there is no instance of a nation benefiting fro, from prolonged warfare. And initially, like I said in one of my previous posts, I was going to start um, bringing the 4th Army um, this way to try to protect the single track rail line and the double uh, track rail line uh, from Kielce to uh, Radom here. Um, still going to do that, uh, for sure. But with the sun, with Sun Tzu telling me, um, yeah, 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 winter is coming, but it doesn't mean you, you, uh, have to start hunkering down forever and ever. Amen. You can try and do something here. So, um, Salsa and the fourth army here, uh, the HQ are going to use and can't move. I, I wanted to move, but they're going to probably, uh, use some divisional breakdown here and pop them on over here. I would love to get them over to Kielce, but it's not going to happen. Not this turn. Um, then, so I'm going to, uh, use this opportunity to try to bring as many fort. Well, these guys won't be able to get there, but at least I can pop them there. I bring as many forces as I can to this spot and try to nail this, this mother right here. Um, um, BG 42 and try to get the Tarnif. Uh, obviously not going to get the Tarnif in one turn, but, uh, and yet again, going to be using, um, what did I call it? The dice roll of death. Yep. I'm going to be using that mechanism for sure. Anyways, that's what I'm going to give it a, give it a go. This is going to be interesting. Okay. Hope you're having a good one.